This clip is to show the concept of a structural opening in a wall. So here's our wall. It's actually a number of cardboard boxes set on top of one another, much in the same way that you would lay bricks. So to illustrate the concept of a structural opening, we're going to form an opening in this wall uh, to put an item in which we can pretend is a window. The, this item is a, another box, so here it is, and we're going to pretend this is a window. Um, we can see that this box is, is going to fit into this wall. It's two bricks high, so from here to here, and it looks as though if we take one brick out here uh, and um, these bricks here, uh, then we can form the opening into which to put this box. So let's have a go at doing this. So we start by uh, taking out this obvious brick just here and uh, as we can, as you probably uh, expected, uh, it doesn't support itself, it collapses in, into itself. Now this is, um, the point about a structural opening is that you have to provide a means of supporting the units above, the ones that are going to fall in. So in, you do this by putting in um, a beam above the opening. Now the technical term for the beam above the opening is actually a lintel. It's a, uh, a structural member which spans across the opening and will support the bricks above it. So you can see we've put that in and we rebuilt the wall. Um, as it was, well, sort of as it was before, but this will do for the purposes of this illustration. So there we are, we built the wall, beam in the wall, um, and now we've still got to, to remove a brick. Um, now this is just manipulated a bit and we can remove this. Um, and, we've, and we've created the opening and so we now want to put the window in the opening and what you'll notice is that what we thought was just two bricks high is actually ever so slightly bigger than two bricks high and won't go into the opening and this brings us to the next point about structural openings is that you've always got to make and this is an obvious point but it's worth sort of stating because it, it happens all the time um, is that you've got to make the opening sufficiently big in order bigger than the component that you're going to fit into it say a window or a door so that when the component arrives on site it can fit into the opening without any trouble so this is remedied in this case by um, uh, where's Wally's going to come to the rescue and uh, the lost sheep and uh, we'll just lift up the lintel put these in and it raises it ever so slightly like that and now we can see that the window or box slides into the structural opening.